welcome back to my channel. So today we are heading off to Bicester again. If you do watch my channel regularly, then you'll know that I absolutely love Bicester. I've been there a couple of times and you guys seem to love coming along with me. So today is a kind of Christmas shopping day. I am hoping that they've got the village all set up for Christmas and that they've got some very cute Christmas decorations because obviously it's a very gorgeous place anyway. So I'm going to try and take you with me again, show you everything that's there because I know a lot of you have commented on previous videos and you've said that you really wanted to go but you weren't sure what was there and how much things were and what was available. So I'm going to try and show you as much as possible and hopefully it should be a really enjoyable video. I'm not sure whether I'm going to be buying anything for myself, but there is always lots of temptations at Bicester, so you never know. But anyway, I'm going to hop in the car, we're going to head on over, and I'll take you with me. Oh, 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 
literally just got back and it's 9 p.m. so we've had a good six or seven hours shopping which I think is possibly the longest I've ever been shopping but Bista is so big now I think as they told me last time it's the same length as the Champs-Elysees in Paris so it takes quite a while to get around and I think we did up and down quite a few times so I'm gonna show you properly what I got tomorrow when it's light because it's probably not the best lighting to show you now. We did do quite a bit of Christmas shopping but obviously I'm not gonna be able to show you that because the people whose gifts they are will find out before Christmas um, what they are. So I'm gonna show you what I bought for myself and then maybe after Christmas I'll be able to kind of show you a sneak peek of what I've got for everyone else. But anyway, I shall see you in the morning. Thank you for watching and I shall show you everything I bought tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Hopefully you can hear me. Hopefully this setup is okay and it's not too bright. I am sitting right by the window, so please excuse if the light changes. But I just thought I'd quickly show you what I picked up yesterday at Vista. I didn't go too mad for myself although I did pick up quite a few bits. But as I said, I did do quite a bit of Christmas shopping, which I can't show you because I will ruin the surprise for the people that I bought for. Anyway, I did pick up some bits from Swarovski, from Reese, and also from Ralph Lauren. So I shall stop waffling and I'll just show you what I've got. So the first thing I picked up was a really beautiful jumpsuit from Reese. This was actually in the window display and it looked really, really pretty. I wasn't sure how it was gonna look on me because it's a very fitted jumpsuit with a strapless bandeau style top, but it's actually really, really pretty and it looks very flattering. I got this in a size eight, which is probably a little bit small, but I'd rather it be a bit tighter, especially when it's strapless because you don't wanna keep hoiking it up all night long. I think I might actually wear this to my birthday party in January or I'm sure I will get lots of wear out of it over the Christmas period as well because it's quite party festive. I mean it's not an overly festive colour but I just think it will be really really pretty for any kind of occasion. It actually says on the receipt that it's a pearl blue colour and I can kind of see that now. But anyway, the jumpsuit was originally £235 and I have actually seen this in the restore 
a couple of months ago, about six months ago now in London. So I know that this isn't something that they just make for the outlets. So as I said, it was originally priced at £235 but I got it for 85 but because I actually had one of the VIP cards I only paid £76.50 because I got an extra 10% off so that was very very good very successful trip to Reese they do have some really lovely bits in Reese actually and every time I go to Vista I seem to find myself picking up several more bits than I expected so if you are planning a trip I definitely head into there they always have amazing discounts the coats actually are incredible if you're looking for a new winter coat I would definitely recommend heading in there next up I popped into Swarovski now I have never been into Swarovski and Bista before it is somewhere that I shop in for jewelry anyway but it's not like mega expensive, so I kind of figured that I didn't really need to, I don't know, it just wasn't on my hot list to go. But anyway, it is situated around the front, so it's not in the kind of walkway of Bista where all the boutiques are. It is a little bit hidden away, but I am so glad I popped in because they have some really, really gorgeous bits. And actually the discounts are more than worth it. I could have gone really mad in there, although I did pick up a few gifts, but I got this ring for myself. This is... I don't know if I'll be able to show you because I feel like jewellery doesn't come up very well on this camera. I will try my best. So I picked up this very, very gorgeous thick layered ring. It is a very thick band. It's studded with diamantes and it's in a sterling silver colour. Sorry, I can't hold this still. I don't know why I'm trying to balance on one leg. But it is really, really beautiful. And let me just get the receipt. So originally, well, I don't know whether it says it on the box, actually. I don't think it does. I think originally it was £69 and I got it for, no, it wasn't. It was £99 originally. Um, there was £50 off and then an extra 10% discount with my VIP card. So in the end, I got it for £44.10, which is very good. It's an amazing deal considering that it's a really beautiful ring and it's not really seasonal dependent. You can wear it whenever. It's going to look really, really pretty for the festive party season and I absolutely love rings. So it's very exciting. By the way, before I forget to mention, I have literally just put together a post all about the secrets of shopping at Vista Village. So if you are looking to go anytime soon and you fancy seeing what tips and hacks and things that I suggest, because not that I'm an expert Vista shopper, but I have been there five times this year, which is quite a lot. So I kind of consider myself a little bit of a seasoned Vista shopper and I will leave the link in the description box if it's been posted already, I'm pretty sure it will, just in case you fancy checking out some of my top tips for shopping there and also getting the best bargains. So finally, I picked up quite a few bits from Ralph Lauren. The Ralph Lauren that they have at Vista is actually the biggest in Europe and since they did their recent expansion it is huge, they've got a whole floor for men's, a whole floor for women's and everything is so nicely displayed. It is such a pleasure shopping there, I mean with all of Vista because all of the shop assistants and the staff in the boutiques are so so helpful but in Ralph Lauren especially I have to comment that it is such a nice place to shop but anyway. I got a few bits, all with a colour theme, if you will be able to tell. But the first thing I picked up was a three pack pair of socks. Not very exciting, I know, but everyone needs socks. And actually I do find socks quite exciting. Um, I now quite look forward to getting a new pair of socks at Christmas, which I never thought I would, but socks seem to just grow legs and walk off themselves. So I picked up these, they were originally 26 pounds. In the end, I got them for 10 pounds and they're really nice, just plain socks for the winter. I also picked up this blue top, which is just a plain long sleeved ribbed top with zipper detailing on the top. It is a size small and it just looks really pretty with jeans and like a big jacket, just really easy to throw on and it's very soft, very high quality. 
So originally this was £65, it was down to 34 and then I got an extra 10% off. So let me have a look how much I paid. How much did I pay? So actually in the end, I only ended up paying £31.49, which I think is really good for a top that I know I will get plenty of wear out of. And then finally, the showpiece. I really didn't need this but I did need this because the boots that you will have saw me wearing yesterday are my favorite pair of Zara navy boots. I wear them all the time, they are so, so comfy. They're heels, pretty much the only heels I can walk in. And I don't actually own that many navy clothes or bags or anything, really. So I kind of figured that I needed this because they say that you should match your shoes and your bags, so that's the motto I followed and this is what happened. So this is my new Ralph Lauren mini bag, if I can open it. It is so adorable. I'm gonna have to get these off and show you the full, full look because I don't think this does it justice with all of this on it. So there we go, it's all unwrapped. This is my very cute new bag from Ralph Lauren. I am so in love with this bag, so impressed. I didn't expect for it to be so cheap and I've had my eye on one of these for a long time. I know the YSL mini sac de jour, um, I've had my eye on one of those as well for ages and I just love this and that kind of shape. The fact that it's, it's mini so you can wear it out in the day and it's not gonna hurt your shoulder, you can't pack it with too much stuff but it also looks really sleek and kind of really pulls an outfit together. So I headed over to this bag, not expecting to be able to justify the purchase, but actually it was so much cheaper than I expected. It looked so gorgeous in the flesh that I just couldn't resist. So I bought it and you can actually get these in red and black as well. It's obviously got the little Ralph Lauren logo at the top. It's got gold hardware. It's got the little, um, what do you call this? The little tag. And then it's also got the shoulder strap so you can wear it as a little shoulder bag as well. So originally, you will never guess, this was 215 pounds. But at Bista, it's Price down to 149.99. I got 10% off, as you know. So in the end, I got this bag for 134.99, which I'm sure you will agree is amazing for what it is. I mean, it is a Ralph Lauren. It is a gorgeous little bag. It's a great size. It's not one of those pointless size bags that you can only fit your phone and one card in or a couple of credit cards. It is a bag that I know I'm gonna use, and as I said, it goes with my boots. So I am very, very excited to wear this. I was initially toying between this one and the black one, but I went for this one in the end because, as I said, it's navy and I've got those navy boots. So I am very, very happy. Can't wait to put it in my wardrobe, and yeah. Hopefully you love it as much as I do. So there we have it. That's my little mini Bista shopping spree haul. Hopefully you've really enjoyed coming with me on this little Christmas shopping trip. Do feel free to stay tuned for the rest of Vlogmas. I'm vlogging every single day this month up until Christmas. And actually I might vlog beyond that as well because I have some very, very exciting things happening this month and I can't wait to share everything with you on this channel and show you what goes on and get really festive and excited about Christmas. So yes, I'm gonna stop waffling because I know this video has probably been quite long, but hopefully you've enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you again tomorrow.